welcome in my new session today i am discussing with pressure pressure what is pressure the force acting on a unit area the force force will be acting on a unit area like this this is the object okay we can apply the force of in this object can be written. okay and this object will be the space of the area is a 10 meter square okay of surface this is the because the surface is called pressure we can apply force of 10 newton area is the 10 meter square it is called pressure in other words we can, we can say that force per unit area is known as pressure force per unit area is known as pressure this is the pressure Pressure equal to force upon area. Pressure denoted by P. P equal to F by A. Force, SI unit of force is Newton. Area unit is meter square. Its unit is Newton per meter square. SI unit of pressure is Newton per, per meter square. And other one is Pascal. It is denoted by capital P and is small a. There is the some conditions. When Pressure is the higher. Pressure is we can increase the pressure. The force is the directly proportional of pressure. When applied to any type of pressure, increasing movement, then the force is also increased. Next, pressure is directly in pressure is inversely proportional is area. When the area is expanded area is expanded then pressure will be decreasing next we are discussing with atmospheric pressure what is atmospheric pressure what is atmospheric pressure you mean arise the question first of all what is atmosphere what is atmosphere the layer of air the layer of air above the earth suppose that this is the earth this is the air. It surroundings air. It is surroundings air. Of earth, it is called the atmosphere. The layer of air above the earth is called atmosphere. Okay. This is the atmosphere. Next question is the arises B. What is atmospheric pressure? What is atmospheric atmospheric pressure? Pressure exerted by air. Pressure exerted by air is atmospheric pressure. Like this, this is the object. It is the exerted, it is the exerted by the pressure of air. It is we call atmospheric pressure. Okay. Atmospheric pressure is due to the weight. Due to the weight of air present in the atmospheric above us. Okay, next point, atmospheric pressure also act in all directions. Atmospheric pressure like this is the object, this is the atmospheric pressure, this is the atmospheric pressure, this is the atmospheric pressure and this is the atmospheric pressure. Apply on this object in its all directions, even upwards. Okay, next topics we will discuss with you, magnitude of atmospheric pressure. Next topic we will discuss magnitude of atmospheric pressure. Magnitude of atmospheric pressure. On the surface of earth, the atmospheric pressure is maximum at the sea level. Surface of earth, the atmospheric pressure is maximum at the sea level. Okay. So question arising will be what is sea level? What is sea level? The base level for measuring elevation and depth on earth. What is the measuring of in the sea level? We are measuring the elevation and depth on earth. Okay, this is we call sea level. Next point, we go up like this. This is the earth and we go up, up direction. Okay, atmosphere from the surface of earth. Okay, the atmospheric pressure, atmospheric pressure is being decreasing. Why? Because atmospheric pressure is against I mean, always work by the surroundings here. We, we go up from the 
center of earth if the surface of earth then the atmospheric is atmospheric pressure is will be decreasing we'll discuss with you this topic is our body and atmospheric pressure our body and atmospheric pressure okay if the pressure due to atmosphere if the pressure where is the from the pressure it is the pressure from the atmosphere is so great so what i am saying if atmospheric pressure is great okay so then why are we not stressed by it so why are not we stressed by it this is the this is the earth okay and we are stand from this from the surface of earth and this pressure will be act of atmospheric pressure of our body so why are not we be stressed inside due to the earth okay this is the question and the we are giving the answer by atmospheric pressure acting on our body atmospheric pressure is acting on our body from outside from outside is balanced by the blood pressure acting from inside the blood pressure acting from inside our body this is the our body and inside our body is blood pressure will be working and outer side of atmospheric pressure from the balance balance is blood pressure okay acting from inside we do not get crust so we do not crust next topic is we will discuss you applications of atmospheric pressure our everyday life what is the using of atmospheric pressure and where was the using of atmospheric we we'll discuss with you application of atmospheric pressure in everyday life where we using the atmospheric pressure of everyday life on the case and we can say that the daily life we use many simple devices we use many simple devices in our everyday life which work on the existence of atmospheric pressure okay for example drinking straw we drink the coconut water we using this this type of pipe it is we call drinking straw like this this shape so it is we call there is the what is the called atmospheric pressure what is the called atmospheric pressure next a syringe a syringe this syringe is used in medical or doctor's clinic okay next a dropper it is we dropper and a rubber stopper thank you so much